Robotics technology is getting faster, smarter and more talkative, but just how useful can robots be? At the recent InnoRobot Robotics event in Paris, so-called cobots, meaning collaborative robots, were put through their paces. Sawyer is autonomously able to sort these red plastic discs. The new so-called high-performant cobot is designed to do machine tending and circuit board testing. I think the future for cobots will be uh, a way to have cobots uh, uh, more and more efficient, more and more easy to program. Uh, the idea is to not to have a single robot uh, in a single place for many months, but to have a robot doing many tasks in just one day. Robots can also help by assisting humans in strenuous tasks. Paris-based RB3D has developed an industrial exoskeleton named ExoPush. Equipped with harness and hand sensor, it's designed to multiply a worker's strength. One guy can have to spread like uh, 35 tons per day. And this, this is awful, yeah? So with this machine, we uh, multiply your strength by 10. So the guy sees only 3.5 tons, which is very good for him. So at the end of the day, he's less tired and he's uh, able for to do more work all day long. Another prototype has been designed to assist people with disabilities. A robotic arm called Jacko Three Fingers has been created by a Canadian company with the aim of assisting disabled people using power wheelchairs. The robotic arm is said to be able to carry out simple tasks without the help of a carer. Imagine that you're stuck in a power wheelchair so you can just slightly move your arms uh, or don't move your arms at all and then uh, suddenly with a harm uh, you can eat by yourself, drink by yourself instead of having a caregiver that is uh, going at your home to, to feed you. Grillbot claims to be the world's first automatic grill cleaning robot. Fixed with nylon brushes, Grillbot is a fully automated device which is driven by a central processing unit which controls movement, speed and the direction of its brushes. All the owner is required to do is push a button and watch the tiny robots scrape away grease and grime. I was having company over, I was getting the grill ready, I opened it up, it was a dirty, greasy mess, and my brush was broken. The, all the bristles were smashed in, it wouldn't work. So instead of going uh, back into town to buy a new brush, I went into my garage and got my power drill, I attached a brush to it, I started cleaning the grill with the power drill, and I thought to myself, why can't you just push a button? Why do I have to stand here over this hot grill and do this? Flexible, useful, highly performant, cobots and robots in the workplace make it a developer's dream. Critics say it'll bring mass unemployment and a new era of social inequality.